Okay, welcome to this video. We want to discuss about orthogonal sets. Orthogonal sets. Okay, we uh, we start our dimension. Let V be an inner product. product space with with an inner product like this okay and and the Induct norm like this. Okay. Now let's start our definition. Definition. Our definition says a non empty set, a non empty set S uh, belongs to V. Uh, to V, okay, of of non-zero vectors, non-zero vectors is called an is called an orth uh, uh, orthogonal 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 set if if for all vector all vectors in s okay all vector in s in capital s uh, are mutually mutually Purely orthogonal. That's mean. That's mean. Uh, that's mean the inner product between x and y and y is equal zero for all for all uh, for all x and y belongs to us such that such that x doesn't equal y okay now the orthogonal set if the orthogonal set uh, uh, if the orthogonal set uh, the, the norm the norm of x is equal 1 for any for any x belongs to us we call it we call it we call it uh, orthonormal 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 set so we have the definition of uh, orthogonal orthogonal uh, orthogonal set uh, if uh, orthogonal set we call it orthogonal set if we have all, uh, all of the vector in s are mature maturely orthogonal that means that uh, the inner product between x and y equals zero for all for all x and y belongs to us such that x the x uh, uh, not equal y and if if all x are equal uh, the inner pro uh, the norm of x equal one for any x belongs to us then we call it Ortho, uh, orthonormal set. Let's take examples. Uh, so, uh, so let's put it again. So, we have x and y. The inner product between x and y is is one if x equal y. Okay, and it's zero if x 
isn't equal y. Let's take an example. Okay, let's take an example in in R squared. Okay, in R squared, such that such that we have uh, let's say uh, x is equal x1 is equal uh, 3 5 4 and x2 equal 3 minus 5 4 okay and e3 or uh, x3 x3 is equal 4 0 uh, 4 0 minus 3 okay we have x1 x2 x3 with the inner product between x and y is equal to the x dot y okay let's try here with our uh, our vectors x1 dot xy ax2 what's equal it's equal 3 3 uh, 3 uh, 3 times 3 9 minus uh, 20 uh, 52 okay plus 16 it's equal 0 and x1 dot x3 is equal 12 plus 0 minus 12 is equal also 0 x3 uh, let's take x2 with x3 is also equal 0 so let's find the the uh, uh, the uh, norm of x1 norm of x1 is equal the inner product between x1 and x1 to the half power and the inner product between x1 and x1 is equal 9 plus 25 plus 16 and it's equal 50 also the inner product between x2 and x2 is equal 50 and inner product between x3 and x3 equal 50 okay now the set the set the set x1 x2 x3 is 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 what is or Orthogonal, 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 orthogonal. But, but it's not, but it's not uh, orthonormal. It's it's obvious because the because the 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 x one dot and a dot x two and x one dot x three and x two dot x three are equals or zero. But but the uh, the the norm of each of them doesn't equal one so it's ortho, uh, orthogonal but it's not it is it is not orthonormal actually if we want to make orthonormal set what we what we do the one we do is to define another another vectors another vectors like v1 is equal x1 over norm of x1 and v2 is equal x2 over norm of x2 and v3 equal x3 over norm of x3 okay let's let's uh, 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 let's see this uh, this uh, uh, those vectors are 
orthonormal or not. So V1 dot V2 is equal. V1 dot V2, what we do is like here uh, V1, V1, V1 is equal. Let's take it here. V1 equal uh, 3 over 50. 3 over 50. Uh, 3 over uh, 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 3 over 50 under uh, square root okay and by under square and here for and so on v2 and v3 are same same so v1 v2 but it's equal it will equal 0 and uh, v1 v3 you can check it it's equal 0 and v3 and v2 with v3 is equal 0 also and we are enough now and v2 v1 v2 v1 v3 v2 v3 okay we are done now v1 norm of v1 is equal the inner product between v1 and v1 all to the uh, to the uh, to the half power let's find v1 norm v1 equals 9 over over 50 plus 5 over 50 plus 4 over 50 and it's equal 50 over uh, uh, 20, uh, 52 uh, uh, 25 sorry and uh, 50 over 50 and it's equal 1 so the norm of v1 is equal 1 and norm of v2 is equal 1 and norm of v3 is equal also 1 so v1 v2 v3 this set this set is orthonormal.